And hello everyone and welcome once again to Resident Evil 2. This is the PlayStation 1 Resident Evil 2. This is the DualShock version actually. I don't know if I have mentioned that lately. Yes, this isn't like the uh, original Resident Evil 2. I unfortunately sold my copy of that. But I still have my uh, DualShock version. So anyways, in the last episode, we did stuff. I don't remember. I don't even know where we are. Um, I put the ink ribbon back and I got all four of the, uh, the chess pieces. That way we can just go ahead and throw those into that door. Where are we? We're in the sewer's disposal, so we did not go up to get that, um... That other drawer, because we have that small key. I was going to try to do that in this episode, but you know what? <sighs> Screw it. I mean, you know, it is what it is. We missed it, so we missed it. No, whatever. So now, we're going to go out this way. I'm not going to worry about it. I think all that was in there was some uh, handgun bullets. I think. I hope. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. So we're going in here. Da -da 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 -da. Going this way. Uh oh. Oh, what the shit is that? Is that that little alien bastard thing that popped out of dude? Oh my god, it is. What the fuck? Oh dear lord. Oh my god. He, oh god. <laughs> he just spits up out of its mouth. Oh, jeez. Okay, um... Let me make sure we got... Okay, it's fully loaded. Alright. Well, here we go. Let's try to see if we can kill this bastard. Oh, look at this. This is good. Get off me! Get off me! Oh, shit. Get off me! Did I kill it? Get the get the You little bastards! I got one on me. How do I get him off? How do I kill him? Oh, shit. Oh, damn it. This is not good. This is not good. I am not going to die. I don't have any... I don't have anything else. Oh, man. Here we go. We're using the Magnum. Oh, I killed it. Get off me, you little shits. Did they go away? Oh, no, they didn't go away. Oh, God, no, they didn't go away. Get, get off me! Ah, oh, fuck. I am not gonna die. Oh, shit. I'm not gonna die by these damn things. Get off of me. Get... I am not gonna die by these damn things being on me. Get the frickin' hell off me. Oh, fuck. I'm not going to die. Uh, there is no way in hell that I'm going to let this game kill me. After everything that we've been through, uh-uh. Oh my god, I'm just about dead. I was wholly unprepared for that. I, I just, that was absolutely... Fuck me, man. <laughs> Dude, okay, so it has been a long-ass day today for me. I have been at work uh, for ten hours. Uh, we had to start doing... Uh, and I don't have any herbs at all, do I? I have one. Damn it. But we had to do a uh, some overtime. So I am like... I am just... I'm over it, you know? I'm like over the whole day. I I'm not doing so bad. It's not like, you know, I'm just... Uh, I just want to die, kill me kind of way. I'm just like, man, I've been sitting in front of a computer in this shitty-ass warehouse for ten hours straight. And I'm just done with it. And I wanted to come in here and I wanted to just, you know, hang out and kill some zombies. But, unfortunately, they threw that big-ass thing at me, whatever the hell it was. Ugh. King plug, rook plug, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, king, rook, bishop, knights. Oh, shit. I like that. Okay. No, not that either. I'm going crazy here. Okay, king. Rook. 
Uh huh. Bishop. Knights. And there you go. Now, the way that I was looking at this, I was looking at this before. Uh, if it's if it's one king, the way that they have it set up should be checkmate. Because the king can't move can't move that way. See, I'm looking at it. It's like, that's not right, though, is it? The bishop would hit it down that way. Now, see, that's not checkmate, though. Because if that's the white queen, white king, sorry, white king, and that would be the knight, I mean, he could move, he couldn't move up because the queen would be right there. So then the one on the bottom has to be the queen. Or unless the one on the side is a queen, because he can't move there and he can't move there. But if he moves there, see, that's not a checkmate. I thought it was a checkmate, but the way they, that they have it set up there, that's not a checkmate. So I don't really know. I don't really know. It's really hard to tell from that angle. I was just, uh, whenever I was looking at it before, I was thinking, well, you know, that could very easily be a checkmate, you know, if they did it right. But that's not... Bleh. Anyways. Oh, what's this? Ada. Ada. And I am trying to turn these cutscenes up for you guys so that we can hear them. What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got bent. I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada, as an officer, it's my job to look out for you. So We're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together, okay? All right. We'll do this your way, for now. So what does that mean? Does that mean Ada's coming with me? So wherever I go, she's going to go, oh my god, do we have to get down in the water? Ew. Ew. Okay, what's, okay, so this is a filtering machine. What does it filter out exactly, I wonder? I'm going this way. It's XDR. But yeah, I am going to be turning up the, uh, you know, whenever they have the talking or the speaking parts, the whatever you want to call them. <laughs> I just, man, they are so hard to hear. And it, I don't know why. I don't know why they're so hard to hear. Man, they're throwing a lot of that blue f***ing herb at me. Oh, get the herb. Look at the flies. Ugh. That looks like uh, our, our back porch the other day. Man, it was really, really cold in the morning. Now you know, It got up, got down to about 50 in the morning. And then through the day, it was about, you know, mid-60s. Or, you know, upper, or lower 60s. And then towards the end of the night, it got around to about a 70. And for some reason, all the bugs came out, and I opened the back door, and we had the porch light on, and God, it's just bugs everywhere. It was horrible. Anyways, uh, sewer manager facts. Uh, user list of the connecting facility. On the first and third Wednesdays of the month, Angelica Margaret, chief of maintenance, will make use of the facilities. Uh, be sure to reduce the moisture levels in the facility by activating the fan, as the equipment she will be using is susceptible to the effects of water vapors. I got the vapors on the 28th of every month i used to know what that meant too i just just a, a side note i used to know what that meant getting the vapors it was something it wasn't so much that i, I it wasn't so much that it was so hot that you were starting to get get um you know sweaty or anything like that there was something else to it something that they used to do you know it's like a drug or something i don't know when you get the vapors that's anyways I'll, I'll look it up sometime for you. On the 28th of every month, the chemical transporter Don Weller will use the facility. The chemicals he will be transporting are extremely volatile. Extreme caution should be observed throughout their transport. On the 6th and 16th of every month, uh, Police Chief Brian Irons will visit the facility to attend the regular meetings that take place in the lab. On the 4th Friday of every month, on the 4th Friday of every other month, wow, 
William Birkin will use the facility to conduct a training seminar for the Chicago branch of Umbrella Incorporated. As the probability of an attack upon Dr. Burton, Dr. Birkin will be high, take every measure conceivable to guard his life. You will be informed of all other potential visitors and the times they will arrive as needed. Guide these individuals to their destination safely. We expect nothing but the best from you. Charles Coleman, Secretary Chief Umbrella Headquarters. Okay, then. That was a hell of a calendar. <laughs> um, okay, so there is a chest there, and there is a typewriter, too. Okay. Yes, I need some handgun bullets. Handgun? Hand handgun. Is that the... Oh, wait a minute. I didn't even mean to do that. There's a door. Well, son of a bitch. I didn't even mean to do that. I seriously didn't. So that's not where we came. No, we came through that door. What? There's all kinds of interesting shit here. A device to regulate the quality of sewage water. Oh, wow. Alright. And yes, more ink ribbons. Thank you. Which we are going to put in here. Uh, we're also going to put some of these away, because we're not going to need them, I don't think. <laughs> we're probably going to need them. <laughs> Who the hell am I kidding? We're going to need them. Um... Do I need anything else right now? I don't... I got a feeling we're going to need that valve handle. <laughs> I'm just saying, I, I got a feeling we're going to need that valve handle eventually. Because we are down in the sewage treatment plant. It's a door to the warehouse. Will you open it? Uh, yes, I suppose. Um, Will you go down the ladder? Sure. Will you... It's our dogs barking upstairs. Gotta love our dogs. Oh, fuck, it's dark. It's too dark to see anything. Yeah, no shit's too dark to see anything. Well, okay, well, that doesn't look good. Is there a... Um, is there a... Uh, oh, fuck me. Look at this. What's this? It's an alcohol lamp. Plenty of fuel remains. Well, then light that bitch. There we go. I see some shotgun shells. Thank you. Oh, we got we got some ammo now, man. They're they're better to throw some shit at us. I'm sure. Anything? 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 Nothing. It's over here. Anything? Anything? Nothing. Okay. It's too dark to see anything. Well, well, how do we light this one up? Oh, okay. Well, there's another <laughs> lamp over here. Do I light this one up? Oh, I was going to say, what's going to happen if I light this one up? Something pops out at me. Take the Magna bullets. Yes. Dude, I am like, I'm fucking Rambo now, man. I am loaded up. Hell yeah. Yeah, if that's all there was to it, shit. <laughs> I'm glad I opened the door. I'm, I'm glad I moved the thing accidentally. Damn. Alright. Um. Well, then I guess we gotta go down. Oh, shit. Come on. Killing me here. I keep thinking that these, uh. I keep thinking that these posters on the wall are gonna tell me something, but none of them ever tell me anything. That sucks. Do, 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 do. Who the hell are you? <laughs> oh shit, did I just get shot? <laughs> Leon. That woman was I had to talk to her. <laughs> so you just got we're just gonna leave him here. We're just like, yeah, fuck him. He'll be okay. Well, okay, apparently there's a sewer map. Yes, I will take the sewer map. Apparently, I can hear Angie B up in her room. Uh, she has a very noisy floor. I don't know if you guys are picking it up or not. What's this, the blood stain on the wall? There are scattered blood stains. Oh, that's that's nice. It's good to know. Am I going up the? 
There's a ventilation slot at the end of the ladder. Will you go up the ladder? Yes, because apparently she's up there moving around. Damn, she's really moving around up there. Wow. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can pick that up or not. Sometimes, uh... Oh, shit. What the... What the fuck? There's a ladder. Yes, I gotta go down a ladder because it's fucking mosquitoes the size of my damn fist. Holy hell! Okay, what's this? Fan regulator. You can stop the rotation of the fan briefly. Okay, but the fan's not rotating right now. Oh, shit. Damn, she's a good shot. Sure, it's gonna hurt like hell, too. Can't hear what she's saying. Ada, Ada Wong. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John, I believe. How did you know? Who are you? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus, William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this, you will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? It's capable of creating the ultimate bioweapon. Its potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is... Precisely... My husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. Okay, um, oh, we got another FMV. Uh, yeah, I had to turn the mic off so I could turn my TV up because I couldn't hear a damn word they were saying. This way. It was so low. It was ridiculous. It's sheer perfection. My precious G-Virus. No one will ever take you away from me. So, she is Annette Birkin. She's William Birkin's wife. There he is. So you finally come. Doctor, we're here to collect the G-Virus sample. Sorry, but I won't just hand over my uh -oh. life's work. <laughs> you dead, bitch! Stop. You might hit the sample. That's it, all right. Okay, let's move out. William. Oh, my. Hold on, darling. I'm taking care of that bullet wound first. Again, this was state of the art back in 99. Just saying. 98, whenever it was. Alpha team, have you retrieved the sample yet? Affirmative. We'll be at the rendezvous point in one minute. Roger. Oh no! Now why would you go and do that, dude? I mean, seriously? Are you telling me that he injected the G-Virus into his own body? The G-Virus has the ability She's got such to a weird neck. cellular functions. Well, what, what was that? Something's wrong. Let's check it out. <laughs> I love the little uh little red sparklies they have on the on their helmets. What is You would think that uh, the red reflective material would kind of contrast against the whole, you know, black motif that they've got going on. Oh wow, he just eating that shit. What, what is this thing? Fire! Fire! <laughs> you dead now, bitch. You son of a You better run, squirrel. Resident Evil 2. Wow. Okay. So those rats were the carriers of the virus. As a result of his virus-induced transmutation, William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human by now. 
even worse. The virus bioweapon including me has the ability to implant embryos into other creatures. And create offspring. No. Oh shit, cat fight. Get her, Ada, get her. Yeah. She done bitch slapped her. Yeah. <laughs> Too bad. Okay. So now what? Should we should we go this way? What's over here? The ladder. Ladder down that way. I guess that goes down to her. I'm looking at the time and we've hit the twenty minute mark and I didn't really want to go I didn't want to go over twenty minutes. So I wonder if we, uh, oh my god. He's holding something. I don't need this right now. What's that? Looks like some sort of book. I don't need this right now. I don't need none of this right now. I don't need this kind of headache, man. So if she goes down, I mean, do we, I know we, uh, we get, uh, we get Leon again eventually. <laughs> I guess I just have to progress until we get back to Leon so I can go back to the save room. No. Uh -oh. Oh shit. Oh shit! <laughs> That's what they all say. Hey, <laughs> giggity! <laughs> Leon, you got shot, motherfucker! <laughs> he looks pretty good for somebody who got shot. Alright, so let's go back up and let's save. That way I know we have a point where we can come back to. Wow. But yeah, I think the uh, I think the blood stain stays with him, and I think what was it? Somebody was saying that um, there was a good sense of continuity. Like if you got one of the uh, if you got one of the extra costumes or whatever, when he gets shot, when you're in the extra costume, the, the extra costume shows blood. I don't know. I don't remember if that was true or not, but I could just swear I I could read that in a magazine somewhere or something. I don't know. Who knows? Anyways, thank you guys very much for coming around. Uh, this has been Resident Evil 2 PlayStation 1 goodness. We're doing this for the entire month of October because Halloween is a thing. Uh, I've been Nicodemus Kane. Thank you for coming around, watching it, checking it out. Um, as always, I say like, comment, and subscribe, or don't. And until next time, I wish you all well in all your future endeavors, and I hope that the world lasts for you. God bless. Take care. Uh, save your bullets. Watch out for those weird blonde chicks in the lab coats, man. Those, those, you gotta watch out for those. And if you can't hear the game, just turn the TV up. That's all you gotta do. Turn the TV up. Just, you know, mute your mic so it doesn't bleed over. You know how it is. Later, people.